For the past nine days, Ghana has played host to 53 other African countries for their 13th African Games. The Games were originally scheduled for August in 2023, but were postponed to March this year because the facilities needed for the Games were incomplete at the time. It's been nine days since the commencement of the Games here in Ghana, but there's been some issues from the blackouts at the Cape Coast Stadium um, to the low turnout at the event centers, um, the seeming lack of interest from the public to other pertinent issues um, affecting these games. Today on the City Newsroom, we are at Bottoman Sports Complex. It's a beautiful um, sports complex completed for the purposes of these games. Uh, we have the aquatic complex where Abeku Jackson won the uh, medal, the silver medal for Ghana in the 50 meter breaststroke event on Sunday. Uh, we also have the multi-purpose um, polyvalent center um, here at the Bottoman complex um, to host games like basketball, um, volleyball and other hand games. And then we also have the dome at the very far end uh, where the wrestling events also took place and then we have one center for table tennis we also have um, an athletic track right down there um, all made ready for these games but why um, do we have still uh, these pertinent issues bedeviling these games after having sunk more than 200 million dollars into these games naturally when you are organizing uh, 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 such an event Hey, you cannot say it will be challenge free, but as and when the challenges come, we are able to surmount them. And that is the beauty of the capacity of our people working with us here. Yes, the issues come up and we are able to resolve them as and when it come up. So there are challenges, but we are able to resolve them because there are people standing aside to assist in any capacity to be able to resolve problems. Yes. But a lot of money, a lot of money has gone into the organization of these events. And we're told that even the mats for the wrestling, and they came in just a few days ago. So what happened is that the mats for purposes of the competition, yes, for the, for the wrestling, the mats came a few days before the competition. But the, the, the federations have their training mats. So this one was not for them to be used for training. The Federation have their training mass that they use for training, and this one was for purposes of the competition. And so it came before the start of the competition, so there was no problem. I mean, don't you think it could have been procured earlier so that athletes could have a feel of what they are going to use for the competition itself? Well, athletes had feel of the match before the competition. It isn't that, that tomorrow is the competition and it came today. No, that is not the issue. But what I'm trying to explain is that this place is for competition. We have other venues that for training purposes. So when they, we, we schedule the, the countries for them to come and have a feel of the venue center before the game, and that was done. But as to when they arrive, where they will be training, they are all earmarked. And every country was aware where they're supposed to go for training and where they're supposed to do the competition and where they should come and have a feel of the venue for competition. Yes. All right. Thank you very much. We're told that there will be a swimming event um, very soon. And so we'll go over there and speak to some of the spectators who have come to see this swimming event. Just about having our next swimming event. Hello, sir. Um, I see you and your kids. Um, you're coming to see the swimming event. Yes, sir. We are coming to um, watch them swim. Uh, what's your name? My name is Franklin. Um, do you live around? Yeah, I live in Ajay Okay. Uh, your kids like swimming too? Yeah, they do. Do they, they swim? Do. They do, they do swim. Okay. They do swim, but it's their first time coming to have a look at what they are doing here, so. Okay. Sure. Um, can I talk to the eldest? <laughs> okay. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. What's your name? Lois. Lois. Yes, please. Uh, do you like swimming? Yes, please. Okay. Are you a very good swimmer? Yes. Are you hoping to represent Ghana in good the games good. sometime? Yes. Okay. All right. Thank you very much, sir. Okay, uh, more people keep coming in um, for the next event, um, which is um, happening here at the swimming um, complex. And um, we'll try and speak to a few of them. Hello, sir. 
Uh, my name is Charles. What's your name? I'm David. Okay. Um, why are you here today? Um, I'm here to watch them swimming. Okay. Yeah. Anyone in particular you're here to see? I'm supporting Ghanaians. Yeah, I'm, I'm from Ghana. Okay, so Abeku Jackson won a medal yesterday. I'm told he's um, swimming again today, so you might be seeing. Yes, yes, yes. That's why we are here. Okay. Yeah. Uh, where are you coming from? Um, I'm from here, Ghana here. I'm coming from um, Kaneshi. All the way from Kaneshi? Yes, yes. Do you have any difficulties with transportation getting? Yeah, traffic, traffic on the road. Yes. Uh, where are you coming from? Um, from Ashaiman. Um, you are here to see the games, obviously. Yes, please. Uh, what games are you particularly coming to see? The swimming. Swimming. Okay. Um, is there anyone in particular you are coming to see? Abeku Jackson. Yes. We just want to see what's going on. We heard a lot about this place, so we just want to come and see, witness it. That's are you, all. Are you, have you, are you disappointed since you've been here? Oh no, it's a very nice place. They've really done the place nice. Why have you come to see these games? Oh, we are in Ghana. So, like, today I'm passing by. So I just want to come and have a look at everything that is going on here. What have you seen so far? Are you impressed with anything you have seen here? Mm, yeah, every place is, is nice. I can say every place is nice. Okay. Yeah. So there's a swimming event um, ongoing in there. I imagine that's why you're here. Yes, yes. That's why I'm here. Anything in particular you're expecting to see? Anyone? Mm, I'm expecting to see a lot, but I'm, I'm now going in, so why not get there? Thank you very much. You have fun in there. Um, Gabi Ofe of the City Sports Deck, he is in there and he is keeping tabs on events unfolding in there for us. And he will bring us a report later.